Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Sarkson and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Season 1, Episode 9, A Sword Art Online Assiliation. Like I said, I'm probably butchering that, but if you've been watching me the entire time, you already know I've been butchering it. So we're doing Season 1, Episode 9, called Mo Nobleman, Nobleman Responsibilities. And we cut to May 17th, the year 380. So we start off with Krita explaining sword skills to Yu-Gi-Oh. They have the same douchey guys that make fun of Yu-Gi-Oh and then they fight but not really because the other two guys are super chicken of everything. Like super chicken. <laughs> and then they see his power of conceit and it comes to a draw. Then Kurita and Yuji would talk, and they're in the woods with their pages, and basically th their pages are girls, and they're concerned about her, their roommate. And basically one of the guys is being, um, is named Humbert, and he's being super sketchy to her. Like, they allude to what they're being sketchy about, but they don't outright say it. But still, it's like hella gross. Like, just gross. So, uh, Kurito and you just said they'll handle it. And so they go to talk to the guys. And they don't care. <laughs> at all. And then, Yu-Gi-Oh! threatens to uh, tell the higher-ups. And then, Kurito warns Yu-Gi-Oh! And he said, like, it might be a trap. Like, you probably don't want to do that. And then we have Yu-Gi-Oh! -Oh tells to this page and basically, uh, first of all, one of the, the page is getting a little flirty flirty with Yu-Gi-Oh! for a little bit. And, but she is afraid of the creeper from a husband because apparently since they're noblemen they can marry whoever they want and whoever, you know, the person they might get might be a creep. So, she doesn't want that. <laughs> And basically wants Yu-Gi-Oh, but doesn't fall on say it. So basically she loses like she wants someone like Yu-Gi-Oh, but she actually wants Yu-Gi-Oh to be her husband because he's a stand-up person. And you just kind of dent, so he doesn't really get it. So yeah. I and that was in the episode. So I give this one a strong A. Uh, it's just the, the creeper people, I'm just like, when they go into creepo mode on the show, they get super scary and the animation gets a little more sinister-like, which I understand is, is understandable, but they go to a step above where I'm like, uh, no, but I mean, overall, like, they, they've always done that type of approach with this entire... Uh, series. They do it a lot on Sword Art Online, Gun Girl Online, and the second part of Sword Art Online 2. I forgot the name of it. Skates me from the moment. But anyway, um, it's just, it's just so super crazy, and you know, that's just how it is, though. And so anyway, that's what I'm doing for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, do you agree, disagree, just tell me your own thoughts down below. I'm interested in what other people think about the show as well. Um, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Uh, bye, everybody. <laughs> I said that weird bye.